So, on to Denerim, Lower Market District. Hell yes. And then... Well, really? Am, am I seeing that right? Is that castle sort of suspended? That's incredibly cool. Doesn't look safe, though. <laughs> or it could just be the draw distance. I think it might be the draw distance, so well. Now, what the hell is I saying? Yeah. Either the Brickelian Forest or Orzammar. Orzammar, Orzammar. Orzammar's all closed up, according to that Dwarven merchant who wouldn't tell me anything more about the whole thing. So I don't know. I, I guess we'll just see. I don't know if I'll make a decision on that this session. Oh, speaking of what I'm going to do this session, uh, before we go to dinner, and we're going to do a couple things. Uh, first of all, I need to... Oh, no. I actually don't want to do that right now. I want to go to the map. I want to go to the world map. And see where we're going. Uh, where's that monster? Where's the monster that they said? It's not the Mage's Clay, dude. It's Chance's board. Be on the lookout while traveling, and it may find you. Strange creatures. Okay. Well, for the road, we are going to take a couple of people we have not taken in a while. Liliana um, Alistair. All that lost it. You guys are going for now. Not having a tank is quite dangerous. Yes. Indeed. Horse feathers. Ooh. Lost damnation. Yes. Indeed. Maybe I'll regret this taking was essentially the 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 not so nice version of my party. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, go on then, go on then. I bet we can survive. Morgan's got Morgan's got a heal. Wait. I leveled you guys up, I guess you all leveled up again. That's cool. Well thirteen warrior now. Let's do them all. Uh to don't do them all, but like do them all. <laughs> Uh, apart from this, uh, Stan, you're doing okay on stuff, I reckon, since you're going to be the main tank now. Maybe I should just get a couple points into your constitution as well, but I did make that mistake before. Uh, let's see what else. At bravery, uh, you could do Sunder Armor. Aims a destructive blow to target's armor and our natural defenses. The attack deals normal damage, but also damages the armor unless the target passes a physical resistance check, which is really cool, actually. We have no idea what we'll be facing on the way. We could get bravery, uh, damage, physical resistance, and mental resistance. Critical chance that increases proportionally to the number of enemies above two of the warriors engaging. Come in handy when considering that he is using the Nug Crusher. Honestly, I think this might be more helpful uh, because this is nice. You know, it's 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 specialized, but as a general thing, I think this I think this in general. So yeah, let's do that. Nice, Zevran. Make it quick. Shut your face. Um, he pumped up his con his cunning a little bit, so now he actually makes use of lethality for a change. Just good. Let's go pump it up more. No, 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 no. There's no point in doing that. Let's get willpower up a bit more, so you can use whirlwind a bit more often. It's going to come in handy, I think. As for everything else, uh, we could get you with master stealth. During combat, very nice. Uh, let's know. Let's get you with a dual weapon thing because, you know, I just we haven't really done much with this tree yet. What's all this stuff? Reposte. Mm. Okay. Well, some of these are pretty good. Wielding a weapon in each hand. Uh, experience with you know, bonus critical chance. Okay, that's good. So these are sort of passive. And in terms of abilities, he's actually doing okay. Instead of getting a sort of usable, well actually this is a mode, isn't it? The character strikes with both, we both weapons simultaneously, attacks cause more damage, but the character cannot inflict, inflict regular critical hits or backstabs. Ew. Hmm. Do I want that? Not really. I'm gonna get this. Well, and the other stuff's really good though. It's just a mode. Consume stamina, that one. Can be handy if he's fighting an actual enemy. So let's get that one. So basically, when he's not in a position to back backstab, he can turn that on. Sounds good to me. Morgan, not even speaking to me. <laughs> Shape changer, shape shifter, and let's get you with a bit of magic, a bit more powerful, and then a bit more into willpower. Don't need much else for all that stuff, anyway. Apart from that, we can get you with an attack spell, but to be perfectly honest, you're good on the attack at the moment. Well, no, actually, let's get you more attack, but maybe something disabling any dead enemy to heal the caster. Uh, it's a, it's a mode, and upkeep is quite hefty. Core resistance. How's your heal? 
She's nowhere near as good as win at, at the whole healing malarkey, and we don't really have that many poultices. Still, you do have herbalism. We'll see if we can make that up. How about walking bomb? Friendly fire is possible with this. The caster magically injects the target with corrosive poison that inflicts continual nature damage. If the target dies while the effect is selective, it explodes, damaging all targets nearby. Although the spell is relatively for whatever. The magic behind the two does not interact. The target cannot be infected with both. Okay. Well, that's kind of cool. Force field. Erects a telekinetic barrier around a target who becomes completely immune to damage for the duration of the spell, but cannot move. Friendly fire possible. Hmm. Do you know what? That come in handy. Imagine Sten wading into the thick of battle, and then Morgan says she wants to cast a blizzard. Can't do it, because Sten's in the middle of there taking them all out. And so... Casting Force Field on Sten, and then Blizzard on the area, means that he is immune to the damage, yet the enemies are most certainly not. That sounds good. Now, I would go ahead and rearrange this stuff here, but uh, to be honest, I can't be bothered, and it's not really that big a deal. So let's just put that over there, and that'll do for now. I think we're ready to go. Alright, team. I know I don't do good as you guys so much. I know I have a go at you. Sorry, did you not know I had a go at you? Well, I do. I do behind your backs all the time. It's a thing. We all laugh about you. But still, today, those of you who are paying attention, will be able... None of you are paying attention. <laughs> I'm going to speak anyway. Today, we're going to go... And we're going to go fight some guys. You guys are going to be my entourage on the way. If any of you wants to kill me during the time, take your best shot. <laughs> Let's go, guys. I just like silly boot today. Oh, it'll work quite well. <laughs> well, I guess there's nothing left to do except travel all the way to Denner. I mean, we could go to Lake Callanhan and see what the stores are like there. Do you know what? Yes, yes, let's do that. Um, Lake Callanhan docks, and we'll nip over to the Circle Tower to see how things are going. And then to Denner. This is the first time I've felt like I'm not meant to be hurrying. This is brilliant. And go to anywhere-ish. <laughs> go back to the Ruined Temple and fight the dragons. Let's go to Lake Callanhan docks first. Go up, nip down. We'll check all the shops here, just to make sure there's nothing else. There is a fight happening right next to Soldier's Pass, I believe this place is called. Okay, we'll see what happens. Uh, it's a trickster whip. Wait. Did we release you in the tower? I remember this. These things, they delight in the unc and seeing mortals suffer. Not that they're necessarily evil, they're just kind of a force of, of magic in nature. They're they're the whim of a trickster. Alright guys. Let's just see what happens here. And before we do anything else, before we do anything else. What is it? Oh hang on, I got I got you with a poison making as well, didn't I? So you can use acid flask and venom and such right like that now. So let's get that there. Move everything down here. Oh, oh bugger. <laughs> Damn it! What was that? What was that mode? <laughs> it was threatened, wasn't it? Yeah. There we go. Okay, so can you make any poisons up? Did I buy a, a corruption agent? Oh, I need improved poison making. Z uh, Zephyr, don't you have that? Yeah, you do. Let's get, make that up. And they put the death ray extra. It's, sorry, we'll be with you in just a second. Um, let's get powerful swings on. And threaten. Morgan, frost weapons. And we may change you into a spider later, depending on how we feel. Uh, you are just fine as you are, really, aren't you? As for me, you can get Mogo out. You guys remember Mogo, right? That's for later. I don't know why I'm so nervous about this. <laughs> Let's just see what happens here. Oh, oh damn it, I almost forgot. Uh, I meant to... Oh, we can't, because we don't have any fruit. Is there any fruit nearby? No, it's just death root. Okay, whatever, let's just do it. Ah! Oh dear. <laughs> They're bloody everywhere. <laughs> um, did I have all of you in hold position? I didn't mean to do that. Actually, no, do it, because Nathan's... You know, we're going to try See, that thing. Uh, use force field on Nathan. Oh! Okay, now Nathan's in the force field, right? But bloody hell, does it run out fast? Um, I wish I could... <laughs> there we go. 
There. Just keep an eye on Nathan. Uh, Stan, that guy's coming out. Go get him. Oh, I go. Okay. They won't know what hit them. Oh! I'm gonna wait in fairly soon. <laughs> Have I killed some already? It's not actually as powerful as I thought it would be. <laughs> oh well. Okay, everybody, everybody, um, how long's the, how long's the blizzard thing work? Oh, we need to keep an eye on Nathan. Apart from that, everybody else, attack. Sorry, I'm just getting back into it, as per usual. Just, uh, everybody just get back and attack him. And Morgan, you two, just get on him, do something. Thank you. Mogo, you two. He's outside the air effect anyway. Just keep an eye on Nathan. Oh. 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 Run for it. Uh, he is frozen solid. So Stan, we're gonna borrow you for a second. Uh, he's still in the area, that's fine. Um, just... Oh man, that's why I can't attack anybody, because he got fall over. Oh dear. No, Stan, just go. Just focus. Oh, he's down anyway. Right, okay, no, back out, back out. Nathan, air. Down this area effect, it's huge. Oh! me and you shall go! Oh, there's a mage! All the way over there. Okay, Nathan, step out, step out, step out, step out. Get yourself health, Poultus. And then it's gonna be your job to take on that trickster whim all the way over there. I'm assuming it's a case of just getting the guy down here, then that's all fine. Uh, however, we don't know that for sure, so let's just make sure that the powerful guy is taken out. Let's finish. And everybody else can stop holding position now. Oh, actually, he's dead. He's not down yet. I really get him. Get on it. That's a, oh, no, no, he's back. <laughs> that was a dirty trick. Get him. Uh, now's a good time for you to be using heal. Except you already did. Okay. We'll freeze him up, will you? Man, they threw that guy down really quickly. Bada boom bada. Nice ones, ever. I am ready. Well, that was fine, wasn't it? Yeah, quest updated, so that would be it then. Then killing people on trade routes was one of the creatures you summoned in the Circle of Magi's Tower. Oh man, that sucks. You know, I had it in my head that you might have teleported out of the time. Oh, that's pretty nice. Two gold as well to boot. Silly, being killing people, I kind of makes you feel guilty. Well, we couldn't have known what would happen. All right, all right. I think I got it there. Uh, Iron Ring. Hopefully I don't think it does anything though. Should have checked. Elfruit. We can make a single health portus and a dead cow. Lovely. Let's carry on. I'll quick save first. I'll get... Here we go. All the way hiking to Lake Kalanad's shores and then everything will be fine. Maybe there'll be different missions here as well, you know. Different mages collective malarkey. Hey, Kester's got his boat bag. That's cool. Templars. A landmark boat, huh? Was this for Glenald? Can I get you a ladder so you can get off my back? Yeah, okay. It's, a, it's just for Glenald with the Mabari dominance thing. Isn't that the point? I'll get we on it. We all be figments of someone else's imagination. Just players in a play. Exactly. You, I, everything. All a dream. But whose dream? And for whose amusement? Some being a Cosmic power. Sublime, enlightened beings. Cosmic power? What, you're serious? They thought of all this grit, all the war. They bloody thought of boils. <laughs> I got a boil the size of your nose on my big toe, and some beings are enjoying this. <laughs> Disturbed, sick bastards, if you ask me. Ahem. I still maintain they're more enlightened than that. If I ever come across one of them... I'll give him a what for. <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> no, again, this is something that I do not want to get involved with, but let's check on the merchant in here. That's why we're here after all. I wonder if something happens if you were to complete the Mage's Collective quest or the Blackstone Regulus quest. I wonder if something comes of that. Oh man, are you, uh, are you one of those people I need to st Sten, leave the poor woman alone. I think she just lost her husband. Hi. Yes? I'm sorry to tell you her husband is dead. What? The 
This is terrible. My beloved. I'm sorry. She acted a bit differently, which made it a uh, different. Hey, why is it getting me to talk to you? Welcome back to the Spoiled Princess. How may I serve you today? Hi there. Of course. What would you like? Health bolts, preferably, but you don't have any, so I'm just going to take this, 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 this. I guess we could take an injury kit as well. We're doing quite well in terms of all things money, as you can see. It's really good, actually. Um, As for Corruptor Agent... Oh, no, I do have that. Oh, Lyrium Dust. I can make some potions up. Nice. As for Elfrit, maybe. Ooh, Silverwood Shortbow. Studded leather gloves inscribed. That's pretty nice. But uh, I imagine we'll come ac across something along those lines eventually. Anyway, we can't buy any... Can't buy any Alfred. Oh well, let's sell that great sword steel that we got it. That we got back in uh, Redcliffe. Anybody else notice I'm tripping over my own words a bit today? It's very weird. At least because I inhaled like half a half a can of a sexicide. Not for fun, I wasn't doing it on purpose. I just <laughs> Oh man. Ugh. I had a bit of a, a fly problem earlier and I had to use quite a lot of insecticide to do it and <laughs> It made me feel funny. <laughs> Not in a good way. Uh. This area here is nice. It's like, it seems like all of Freldon is dotted with these ruins from ancient places, you know. Obviously repurposing hasn't really come along yet. I suppose back in old times, there must have been old ruins everywhere. People just moved on from places and nothing else got done with them. Let's go across the Circle Tower, guys. Holy shit, Morgan's here. Morgan, run! <laughs> Lost and damnation. <laughs> We're not taking Morrigan to the fucking Circle Tower. Welcome back, youngster. Looking to go across to the tower? Nice to see you got your boat back. Gregor came by, said I could have Lissy back. He seemed sad and tired. Well, yes, but it kind of all did work out, so I would like to go to the tower. Off we go, then. Thank you.